From Tampa Bay Streaming News Leader, this is ABC Action News. Hello, I'm Sarah Finney. Greg D has your full weather forecast coming up, but first, here are your ABC Action News headlines. Today is phase one of Governor Ron DeSantis' plan to reopen Florida. Retail stores and restaurants here in the Bay Area will be allowed to reopen at 25% capacity. State parks will also reopen. Pinellas County beaches will allow the public as long as they remain six feet from each other. Groups of 10 or more are not allowed. An additional 250 law enforcement officers will be along the 35 mile stretch of coastline to make sure people are following the rules. Manatee County will also open beaches and Sarasota County will expand beach access. Hospitals are now allowed to resume elective surgeries. Tampa General will start those procedures again today, but they want you to know that patient access will remain limited. Advent Health is waiting until a week from today to restart elective surgeries. In the meantime, all staff and patients are getting tested for COVID-19. After a long wait, you can now check the status of your unemployment benefits. The Connect system just came back online after being down all weekend. The state used that time to make website improvements and process claims. There are some changes you need to know about. There's a new website where you can modify your claim filing date. This will allow you to get retroactive pay dating back to the day you lost your job. Tampa Bay's SBCA says it's seeing a spike in the number of wild animals in distress being brought into its facility. The number has nearly doubled. Staff says they're seeing baby possums, blue jays and bunnies, even some baby owls. They say if you find a wild animal in distress, call them because oftentimes the mom will come back to see the baby. We have their contact information on abcactionnews.com slash links. Right now, more personal protective equipment is on the way to Florida. Governor Ron DeSantis says the state has signed a deal with the company Honeywell to get 12 million N95 masks. Those are the medical masks healthcare workers use to protect themselves. The governor says these will be delivered on a rolling basis and given out to frontline workers as needed. Now let's get over to Greg D with a look at this beautiful forecast. Hey, Greg. Beautiful it is, Sarah. Temperatures climbing well into the mid 80s this afternoon. Sunny skies, and although it will be a little warm at 85, that is our normal high temperature for this time of year. Dew points in the low 60s, so it's not going to feel oppressively humid. Skies will be mostly sunny through the day with just a couple of fair weather clouds. And the winds light, but increasing to about 10 miles an hour during the afternoon, especially along the coast where the temperature will be held to near the upper 70s thanks to a cooling sea breeze. Wherever you're headed in the Bay Area today, your latest hour by hour forecast always available in our free ABC Action News app. Sarah. OK, thanks, Greg. You can now get news 24 hours a day on our free streaming news channel. Just download the ABC Action News app on Roku, Amazon Fire, Android and Apple TV. Have a great day.